We learn about factors, multiples, prime factorization, common factors, prime numbers, and composite number. Woo! But how do we find LCM? Stick around and watch till the end! Hi, I'm Nack. Hi, I'm Tack. Welcome to Nack Tack 910! Least common multiple. Today, in this lesson, we're going to learn about least common multiple, or LCM. What is least common multiple, and how do we find it? Let's say we have to find LCM of 4 and 6. Can you help me find multiples of 4 and 6? Multiples or factors? I'm confused. Nope. There's a lot of difference between multiples and factors. Okay, let's look at the difference of both. To get the multiples, we multiply the given number and the whole number. Or, to get the multiples, you can skip count that number. For example, 4 times 1, 4 times 2, and so on. So it's 4, 8, 12, 16, 20. And the list goes on and on. Multiples are infinite. The list goes on and on. There are many as in M. M as in monsters. Multiple monsters. On the other hand, two numbers multiplied together to get the given number are called factors. You multiply the numbers to get the number in a question. For example, 25. 5 times 5 is 25. How many ways can 25 be written as in factors? 5 times 5 is 25. 1 times 5 is 5. Factors are like cutting the number down. Factor ninja or fruit ninja. They're very limited. So, we're finding LCM, least common multiple. For that, we need multiples of both the numbers. Now, can you tell me the multiples of 4 and 6? Multiples of 4 are 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, etc. Multiples of 6 are 6, 12, 18, 24, etc. Great job! The next step is to find the common multiples of 4 and 6. Look for the common multiples in the list. So far, from we listed, 12 and 24 are in common. So the common multiples of 4 and 6 are 12 and 24. And there is still a lot more. LCM itself means it's the lowest or the least common multiples. So it's the first common multiple of the list. So in this case, 12 is the first of the least common multiples of 4 and 6. That means LCM of 4 and 6 is 12. I think I kind of got that. Try one yourself. Find the LCM of 2 and 5. Yeah, sure. Let's first list out the multiples of 2 and 5. Multiples of 2 are 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, and so on. Multiples of 5 are 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, and so on. Multiples of 2 and 5 are 10, 20, etc. Among these common multiples, 10, 20, etc., the first multiple is 10. So the LCM of 2 and 5 is 10. This method of finding least common multiple is easy for small numbers, but for large numbers, it kind of gets complicated and time taking for us to keep listing the multiples like this. No worries, let's talk about an easier way to find LCM for larger numbers. I'm excited! Math is easy and fun when you understand your concepts with a little bit of practice and loads of fun! Like and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click the notification bell for more fun videos. Make sure you share it with your friends and family to have math fun.